I was very depressed when I was 19. I just hit the ground running, did it on my own. And I would go back to my apartment every day and I would just sit there and I, it was quiet and it was lonely. And I used to, I had a television and I would leave it on like all the time just to feel like somebody was hanging out with me. Lady Gaga. One of the world's most popular and successful artists on the planet today battled with some of the same problems you may be facing today. I'm going to give you five easy tips to turn your life around just like Gaga. Hi, Leslie Timble here, registered psychotherapist, and today I'm going to give you five easy tips that you can implement today on how you can overcome and crush self-doubt to have a happy and successful life. Tip number one. As Lady Gaga says, honey, I was born this way. At the beginning of that verse, she sings, there's nothing wrong with loving who you are. Bottom line, accept yourself as a unique individual with strengths and weaknesses. I want you to consider accepting your imperfections as a natural part of being human. Focus on self-acceptance rather than seeking your approval or validation from others. Tip number two, get support. Lady Gaga publicly acknowledged the support of veteran jazz singer Tony Bennett and TV director of American Horror Story director Ryan Murphy. She referred to them as her emotional mentors. So what you can do is surround yourself with positive influences. Spend time with people who support and uplift you and avoid those who bring you down or constantly criticize you. Tip number three, practice self-care. Gaga has shared that she practices meditation and yoga, so give this a try. Tip number four, take care of your physical health. Gaga shared it helped as she began to prioritize getting regular exercise. So if you add on also eating a balanced diet and prioritizing sleep, you're on the right track, baby. Tip number five, seek professional help. Gaga realized that she couldn't overcome these dark feelings on her own, so she hired a therapist. In therapy, she addressed feelings of self-blame, shame, and feeling damaged. Everyone needs a helping hand from time to time. So consider hiring a registered psychotherapist like myself to provide you with personalized strategies, support and guidance to help you finally overcome low self-esteem and reclaim the unique and powerful individual that you are. If you got value out of today's episode, it would mean a lot to me if you like, share, subscribe, and ring the bell so you won't miss any of my future videos of free strategies. I also have another video I want you to watch. It's called How to Forgive Yourself. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please comment below. Until next time, I'm the Iron Therapist, Leslie Timber, reminding you to keep your mental game on.